Hey, everybody called me the journey man, so I mean, I've been moving offense, defense, back offense, whatever it is, but uh, like I said, I came here to contribute to the team the best of my abilities and help the team win, get wins and everything like that. So I really didn't have that mindset like, oh, I don't want to move again. I just was trying to help. Where are you in playbook knowledge and chemistry with quarterbacks at this point? I'm pretty good. Uh, we're trying to build, like I said, the first couple of practices, we're trying to get, you know, eye to eye on the same level, same page and everything like that, and we're trying to make plays. That's the thing. Chaz Elder, um, I like Christopher Moody, Chris Lamarns is pretty good, and uh, Rashad Fenton, Rico, they're all pretty good, pretty, you know, pretty good DBs and stuff like that. They're intense, they, you know, they try to get their ball hawks, actually, so. Um, Matthew Belton, he's good, he's good behind me. Me and him, we've been trying to focus together and just make each other better and stuff like that. We teach each other, he teach me things, and uh, since he's been in the wide receiver, uh, wide receiver position long, longer than I have, and uh, everything. So I'm just learning from him as he's learned from me. That 100-yard uh, like, I... rushing game you had against Coastal Carolina, does that seem like it was a lifetime ago? <laughs> yeah, that was a long time ago in my eyes. I wish I, I had more time to do that again, but we'll see. So. I, I mean, did you think after that, like, you know, your, your career here, I mean, could you foresee a career path for you after that? And I mean, how different has it all turned out? Um, I thought it would, but it didn't turn out that way. So now I'm just trying to make it happen again. So. If you don't break your, your foot, do you think things are different in that respect? Um, yeah, I think it would have been. You know, that's a big downfall, you know, injuries. You know, you have to stay healthy in the SEC. You have to stay healthy. So, yeah. Have you been able to leg up with those DBs, knowing a little bit about what they do after being over there? Yeah. You know, it's easy reading the coverage, but like I said, it's even better if I learn the coverages even more. So, like I said, it's a lot for me to learn and a lot for me to, you know, contribute. So. Just give them a little bit more lip sometimes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I guess. With all the bouncing around you did, at some point it had to get frustrating though. I've got to sit down constantly from the coaches and say, look, put me, out, put me out of one position and settle on that and just let me go and play. Yeah, it was frustrating that point in time, that, but everything like that. But I just couldn't show negativity. I had to always stay positive and uh, God's willing, he, he want, he, it's my time, so I have to take, take advantage of it. How much have you played up to Friday, Friday this year? Um, a lot. I've been working on it since January. So. What about prior to, the, prior, to, prior to this season? Didn't you? The first two or three years here, you played all and any receiver at all? Or no, it's just you played in high school. Mm, uh, no, I didn't. Oh. I played running back, strictly oh. running back in high school. So.